Hey, what's up guys? This is going to be a quick update. Uh, there's not a whole lot of change from the last video. I haven't had a whole lot of time to work on this. Doing a lot of stuff around the house. Uh, so last time I left you with this, where you can see these shrouds and they're, uh, they're printed. I think I'm going to go ahead and just JB weld or some sort of epoxy there. I got a lot of comments uh, about the like hot glue. And I've also been using JB weld recently, so I'm going to... I think I'm gonna make it quite permanent. Uh, but here's another addition. I think I'm gonna revise these though. So they're not the perfect fit uh, because I wasn't able to like round off the edges like I was with the, the points here uh, in the thing for some reason. I wasn't able to do that. But also, uh, I'm missing a piece down here. Uh, so a couple of options, I can either keep these on here and glue them on and then glue on another piece which I might do or uh, I might try to like brush up the design it depends but the coolest thing is is this check this out I'm gonna twist the camera see that see that over there I got that server for 15 bucks and in a server that's complete which it is you usually find these fans it's really cool uh, Alex Vince left a comment on my last video thanks man uh, duly noted on the whole uh, directional airflow and pressure and all that. Uh, so check this out. This thing makes a lot of noise. It's actually the bigger of the two because you can see there's two fans per thing. And I'm familiar with server rooms? They're usually really loud. I, I think a loud cooling battery is a better one than a quiet one so I don't forget about leaving the fans on or whatever. But uh, running at like 14 volts here. <laughs> the amount of airflow that's coming out of this, even with just the two in series, is is really good. Um, so prototype, I might just feed off of a couple uh, portions of the battery, you know. But um, I'm not quite sure yet. I might go ahead and just get the converter to drop the voltage. Yep. But today I'm gonna get to designing the shroud for this so I can mount it here. And that's gonna be awesome. Let's try to do this, there we go. See, there's a closer look at the fan. Watch it, watch it run close up. Ooh, maybe if I could just grip it, right? Hmm. I don't know if you can hear the wind on the camera, but that's a whole lot of flow. Uh, compared to what I just wanted, which was just like gradual flow going through. Gonna be pretty cool. So if you have any suggestions, please leave them in the comments below. Uh, or if you want to like link any parts that I can buy on Amazon or somewhere online, that'd be good. So yeah, the next video I hope to have the sides glued on. Uh, all the shrouds glued on, plus the fan mounted. And... I'm gonna also try to get to the wiring. My problem is though, once I do that, the, my plan currently leaves me to where it'll be one big battery pack because I wanted to use these uh, the power plug right here so I can just charge and balance everything. And I gotta figure out how to like make this one piece with maybe like a handle or something, I don't know. If you have any ideas there, I would like to hear that as well. I'm thinking maybe like quarter inch plywood. Gosh, that sounds cheesy. And uh, making some sort of a box that can ventilate with a, I don't know. <laughs> oh man. I might have jumped into the deep end on this, but I will find my way to the surface. It's gonna happen. Hmm. It's very, it's very uh, Tesla inspired. If you go see some of their patents, uh, they have cooling running through their earlier models, and it looks like that P100D or even just the 100 uh, kilowatt hour packs are just all squished together, similar to this. But I don't think there's any space, and they just run cooling like on one side. It might even be refrigerant. I can't remember. I've only seen the patents once. But yeah, keeping your batteries cool. Uh, when they're getting hot, good idea. And then uh, once I get all this set up, I'm just going to hop on the thing, turn on the fans, have it full charge, and just go full throttle 
for a very long distance and see what happens. Yep. But next video, like I said, shrouds, uh, glue and stuff will be on there. Oh, well, I hope that helped. I'm tired. Ah.